what's going on guys it's been a few weeks since uh since the course exhaust video but as you see we're back again um this is what we got a few mods have been done to the car since the Corsa didn't video just because of time constraint and trying to get things done so uh this uh let's take a look around the car nothing exterior wise same old same old but let's take a look at the first few mods let's see if i can get a light so first mod we got the jlt five inch cold air intake got it well because we had to get rid of that um performs well the only thing i didn't like about it is the heat shield that comes around it did not fit it wouldn't let my hood come down so the second mod we did was got some long tube headers 178 from texas speed uh believe it or not they perform really well make it really give a deep rumble to the car um they perform well with the courses uh, and it's not loud inside the vehicle that's the one thing i love about this camaro i cannot hear the exhaust hard i can hear it but i can't hear the exhaust being so freaking loud that i can't hear myself think as with the shelby i had previously i couldn't think i couldn't talk and i, I just i couldn't i couldn't handle it <laughs> so uh but inside the car i can hear myself think i can talk to people at a normal volume where i'm not over here screaming or anything like that so uh but needless to say got long tube headers got the tune for it well <laughs> shortly after that i got a mod on this car that y'all can't see um but uh <laughs> actually got two mods so yeah i'm gonna let you hear it i like it i like it a lot uh but uh let me uh let me go set the gopro up and i'll let y'all hear the the new mod and i'll explain more afterwards and cut that off uh i don't know how my neighbors like me right now um so uh needless to say i'll go ahead and explain it's got a texas speed f35 stage 4 cam all right double uh, valve springs dual valve springs with titanium retainers push 7.4 push rods all that dod delete ls7 lifters um the other thing i got is a fti 4k stall it drives like normal and i'll post a v on that next time but needless to say i'm really enjoying the cam it really gets a lot of looks it's really loud um when they say when you add a cam it's gonna make your car louder they're they're telling the 100 truth um i'll back it out and let y'all hear it outside of the garage with the inside of the garage it echoes like a madman um uh, it's pretty it's pretty rowdy cam i can be sitting and the whole car be shaking <laughs> but that's only at idle um it's it's a very rowdy cam i i love it love it uh we got it tuned for it a couple of nights ago didn't get no videos 
because it was dark and there was no sense in it. Um, we're going to be eventually taking it to a dyno. Uh, let's see. I got more mods coming for the car. Uh, I hate that I didn't video the install because, well, it, it was just... It was one thing after another, guys. I, uh... I broke a valve and I broke an oil pump. So I had it, I, I did this install in four days. It can be done in a day and a half, but it was just felt like it was one thing after another. I couldn't get the oil oil uh, pickup two bolt out. My hands are too damn big. So I got my buddy Dakota to come over here. He helped me get it out. Well, putting it back in for some freaking reason, my pickup two where the bolt goes in it got bent up so it was putting pressure going against the oil pump broke the bolt so order new oil pump fixed the pickup tube got it where it was seat i put a girdle on it so we ain't gotta worry about oil pressure we got two bolts in it um but i do want to give a huge shout out to the guys over all all out performance llc here in atmore alabama dakota madison brian Rowland y'all guys are awesome brian thanks for letting me use the lift get the converter put in dakota thanks for tuning the car thanks for helping me putting the converter in if it wasn't for those guys and everyone else over there uh josh brown cody helton um let's see who else was over there it, just just all all the guys that have helped me on this car I want to give you a huge shout out to them guys they they are wonderful they've helped me throughout this process this is my first well not first ls second ls motor that i've ever worked on and for them guys helping me i appreciate it a lot uh but let's see uh that's that's about it guys i it's gonna be a short video um I'll give a video on the converter uh, next time. Next video come up, you'll you'll see a uh, video on the converter. Uh, it'll probably be I'll probably make the video today, but you know, so don't say no. Oh, he's wearing the same clothes. Nah, <laughs> making videos, guys. Trying to get back in the role of it. But uh, again, thanks for those guys all our performance. Thanks to you guys that watch these videos, and uh, I have uh, I have some more videos coming out. So. Uh, until next time, we'll see you.